I am moving out of the home that I spent a decade of my life in. Okay, so let me back up a little bit. <laughs> My family moved into this house in 2013. I was 13 years old. And now that I'm almost 23, so much of my life has been lived in this house. I started making videos in this house. My friends would come over and we would film my school video projects here. I started and graduated from both high school and college while living in this house. I have made so many memories here. And I didn't even realize it until I knew that I was leaving. Change can be so difficult at times. I honestly get scared when I think about it because there's all these thoughts in the back of my mind. Am I doing the right thing? Why can't I just be like everybody else? Maybe this would be easier if I got an apartment and a 9 to 5 job. It's hard to know the path you chose is the right one. But I can't picture my life going any other way. So there's this quote that I read recently, and uh, it goes a little something like this. If you obsess over whether you are making the right decision, you are basically assuming that the universe will reward you for one thing and punish you for another. The universe has no fixed agenda. Once you make any decision, it works around that decision. There is no right or wrong, only a series of possibilities that shifts with each thought feeling, and action that you experience. Which is so comforting to think about because it's so true. <laughs> of course, there's right and wrong things to do in situations, but in the big scheme of things, if you're doing what feels right for you, it's the best decision. And for me and my family to move out of this house... It feels right. As sad as it is, it is very much time to move on. Change has never really scared me, which I feel very fortunate to say because I've known so many people who let change hold them back. And that's just never been me. I'm so much like a possibilities kind of person. <laughs> Like, there's so much potential for me in this world. How could you just go through life and not explore that? It's, it's just not how I am. I'm very, very much excited to make change in my life. And that being said, change is still scary. Change is hard. It's an adjustment. It's something that obviously... Half the time, I've never done things, and then I throw myself into them, and I'm doing it now, <laughs> and I just kind of have to get used to it, and I thrive on that. I really do. I love challenging myself, 
I love being able to do things that most people think they can't do, which is another point I want to bring up because that is such bullshit to me, for lack of a better term. There really is no other term. Like, to think that you aren't capable of doing something, that's holding you back right there. Like, sure, there are monetary things that hold you back or... There are physical, tangible things that do hold people back from doing things. And I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about the people who sit at home watching TV or watching YouTube and they're like, oh, I wish I could do that. And they can. You can. You just have to believe in yourself to do it enough. Like that is literally the only requirement that's not something tangible for you to be able to go out and do something. I've always found in my life that if I set my mind to something, I get it done. I do it. If there's something I want to do, I save up money for things or I, I I know money's coming up a lot because that is a really big factor, right? That's, I have my fair share of like, I'm a recent college grad, okay? And things are hard sometimes, like to have money, but it really is a mindset From getting yourself to where you are now to where you want to be, it starts with believing that you can. And I've always felt that. That is so important for me in my journey with my camper. I learned how to drive a truck. I learned how to drive a truck with a trailer. I'm going to be driving 1,500 miles just straight out of the gate having driven my trailer twice. (laughs) That would scare people, and it kind of scares me. But I'm not letting that hold me back. So, yes, I am leaving the house that I spent a decade of my life in. And I have so many memories here. Good memories, bad memories, everything in between. As sad as that makes me feel, I know that this is what I'm meant to be doing because it is what I want to be doing. And it feels so right in my gut. The sadness is completely overwhelmed by this excitement of the potential that I have waiting for me. As soon as I step out of this house, so for everything that has happened in this house... I am grateful. I will always remember living here, living in Wisconsin. My friends that I made, going to school here, literally everything. I'm so grateful to have lived here. And I can't wait to come back in the future with the new experiences that I'm going to gain out on the road. And hopefully... The world won't feel so small anymore. I'll be able to come back to the small town that I called home and see it completely differently than when I left. (sighs) Next stop. Florida.